This is Paul Semtex Daily. We've got a big fight coming up. Cage Contender 16 over in Dublin, Ireland. Show I haven't fought on before, which is a bit unusual because I've fought on most shows around the world. Got a, a tough opponent in French, French guy, Patrick Vallet. Trains at Hoyt Tension over in France. I've got a number of guys that have been coming in and out of training camp. A Jack Mason, former Cage Warriors champion. A kid called Josh Kay, excellent wrestler, great up and comer. Payne the Punisher, guys phoning in from New Zealand. He's a New Zealand Thai boxing champion. As well as my own spirit dojo guys that I've managed to get some decent rounds with twice a week, you know, there's a lot of up and comers there. They're young, uh, they're novices, but there's a lot of potential in all of them, so I get good rounds with them. I'm also going to be sparring over in Newark with the ISKA Intercontinental Champion, uh, Charlie Boy Sogden, who's just been named as one to watch on a lot of the kickboxing websites. He'll be fighting for glory uh, in March in London, so he's a high-level kickboxer. Now that we're at Spirit Dojo, I'm able to structure my training as I need it. Not too much has changed. Uh, we've got seven o'clock, we've got Rupert Smiley, you know, we do our pads. He's uh, my long, long time coach and mentor. Been around for about 12 years. So I'll do my pad session, I have my conditioning sessions. And a new one that we've added, added into the training regime is yoga. Yoga's really great for my re relaxation. It's been helping with my breathing uh, and flexibility which is uh, all important for fighting. We've got Ramon Cordington, who's in, in camp here with us as well. He does a jiu-jitsu. Uh, we've got Brent Crawley, who does a wrestling, as well as Coach Dave, Coach Delacchio, and Coach Toby, who are conditioning coaches and uh, pad holders. Up, one, two, three, four. I've been working on some new stuff, uh, not specifically for this fight, but just generally, I, I would like to, to be a, a more dynamic and more unpredictable fighter. So I've been working, fighting as a southpaw, um, which which is going to be, I think, going to be hard for people to figure out. I'm not saying I'm going to fight southpaw this fight, but you know, I now have it in my arsenal that I'm, I'm quite competent at fighting, sparring, and I'm hitting pads or whatever. I can do it as an orthodox fighter or as a southpaw. So. Uh, that should be something to look forward to in these fights. I don't really have a message for Patrick Vallet. I think he knows what it is. He's been brought in as a hand-picked opponent. Uh, she'll treat him as a hand-picked opponent and the fight will be short, but it'll be entertaining. And obviously I'm gonna knock him out, as I do most people. <laughs>